So Alma's people, they had some time, right? Where they're mm -hmm. able to teach and learn. When they end up getting discovered by the Lamanites, there's this really cruel twist of fate. And it's one of those things where you could complain because Amulon, the wicked priest, mm -hmm. through a series of events, has ended up getting favor of the Lamanites, even though he consistently makes these terrible choices, right? Maybe the Lamanites recognize mm -hmm. something. Hey, you like being in charge of people. <laughs> we can do that. And so he's placed mm -hmm. over Alma and their people. And it's personal. Mm -hmm. And we heard Lamanite's people cried out to the Lord. Alma's people are forbidden from praying out loud. Mm -hmm. But then we get in chapter 24, verses 13 and 14, as Alma's people pray silently in their hearts, they get this response. And it came to pass that the voice of the Lord came to them in their, in their afflictions, right? They're not getting delivered out, but in their afflictions saying, lift up your heads and be of good comfort. For I know of the covenant which he made unto me. He's reminding them and trying to anchor them in that moment. And I will covenant with my people and deliver them out of bondage. So one, look back to the covenant you mm -hmm. made, look forward to redemption. In the in-between space, this is what he says in verse 14. And I will also ease the burdens which are put upon your shoulders, that even you cannot feel them upon your backs, even while you are in bondage. And this will I do that ye may stand as witnesses for me hereafter. That was part of their covenant to be witnesses in all times, in all things, in all places. Well, now they're not thinking, why? Where is God? They're going, I can be a witness of this. I can be a witness mm -hmm. that God was with me day to day in my extremities. And that ye may know of a surety that I, the Lord God, do visit my people in their afflictions. That's what he wants them to know. And when they know that, when they recognize that, they spend a lot less time wondering when is it going to come and trying to deliver themselves. Instead, they're able to bear it with some grace. <laughs>